Hey guys, Danny the Medic. Welcome to the channel. Now today, I got a big one for you guys. You ready? Here we go. Alright. Now check out the view of this elevator as it goes... Guys. Guys. I have a review of a big room. Guys, come on. You know, it's a food and travel channel. It, it is the Chinese. So, now, what I have for you is what's known as the, uh, it's a long one, guys. Here I go again. All right, the name is long, guys. It's going to be the uh, Luxor Pyramid One King Corner Suite Big. Right? That's as much as I can remember it here. Uh, here it is right here. All right. So, hope I got it right. All right, let's see now where is it? Where are we going? Hmm. Which way, which way? I guess it's this way. Now, it was my first intention to do this live, but then I realized that the internet here is horrible, and uh, that would have just been, you know, really, really bad. Here we are, guys. All right, I'm gonna turn the camera around, and we're gonna take, check it out, check it out. Never been in there before yet. Not yet. So it's like as if live, you know. Yeah. I'm not even gonna edit out like my mispronunciations and everything. Here we go. Uh, uh. Okay, so we come in. My goodness, this is pretty big guys. Maybe first I'm going to turn on all the lights. Wow. All right, so. Can change lens. And here we are. All right, so coming in, we see, ooh, it is big. Heavens. All right. Wow. Okay, so I'm going to do this in my traditional manner, which is to turn on every single light so we can see better. I believe there should be a lamp here. Aha, uh -huh. a lamp here. Turns on the, uh, this lamp here. Let's open the windows and see what's outside. All right, so that's that. Wonder if I have even more lamps to turn on. Here's a desk lamp. And all right, now all the lamps are on. I'm gonna come back over here now. All right. So this is the door that we come in from. As you enter, immediately on your right, we have this here bathroom which we'll do at the end all right so then we're coming in and over here we see a open closet yep we see that over here's the door to next door I always like to make sure it's fully engaged then we got a full-length mirror subscribe guys got over here this here hmm Bedside table, which, how do you open this thing? Ah, you reach under and pull because there's just like n no handles whatsoever. All right, so nothing in there. We got here one king bed. Now over here we got the same thing. You reach underneath here. Nothing in there. You got a, uh, a beach looking chair, you know, and a little table for you to enjoy the beach looking chair. All right, now we got the, uh, the gem of the room over here, which is a huge soaking tub meant for two people. Right? I've had, I assume it's meant for two people because it looks like it got two seats, one over here and one over there. 
right? Obviously, then you can fit another two, the one leaning back over here, one leaning back over there, right? And then you can fit two more, really, because this is like a high volume tub. You can fit so many people in here, guys. You know, like, I could just imagine, you know, you bring all your friends, throw them all in here. Yep. Uh, I don't know if they'll still be your friend afterwards, but maybe that one freak out of your group is going to be like, Hey man, when we're going to go to Vegas again and soak in that tub, man? You're going to be like, sir, that was a joke. You were supposed to not call me anymore after that. Now we got over here a window, which is a view off. Don't hit, better not hit my head. Ah. Something outside. I'm not quite sure what's outside. It looks like a court building. Oh well. All right. Now over here we got an air conditioning unit, a lamp. Over here this entertainment type console with what looks like an angled uh, handle for your pooling pleasure. Look at that. I wonder why they did that. Why not just four big ones? You know, the side drawers were just totally unnecessary. It really was, guys. I mean, like, what is it that you're going to store in there that, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's designed the furniture. All right, about a 50-inch television, which is pretty good and not too thick. Oh, here's a smaller television and a different style of... Uh, Little console over here. Let's see what's in here. All right, just some emptiness, kind of like you know, my heart. And then we got empty space over here. Another window. Let's see if we can see better. It it just looks like a courthouse next door. I don't know what it is. You know, that traditional concrete looking thing. Now over here we got a bookshelf. I know it's a bit dark, but it's like a bookshelf ended. Like, let me, let me put my foot in there so you can see. See, look, it's like a bookshelf type thing. Uh, couch. Hmm. You got an object there. It's one of those uh, rich people decoration things. What is this? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's what that is. And let's see, we got some art on the wall. A little table for your telephone. A lamp. Hmm. The thing to put the luggage on. A fridge out in the open in the wild. Nothing in there. Now we got a little desk for you to put your computer on. Got a magazine. Ooh, this is a nice chair. This guy, it, it, you can feel that it's like quality stuff. Quality, guys. And we have in here nothing. What is this? Vagon Va Benz? No idea what that means. Glass table. Hmm. Uh, I, I don't know if you can consider this art. It's just something... It's like they primed the canvas ready to do something and they, ju they just hung it up. My guess. Okay, now. Subscribe, guys. Coming around into the bathroom where the lamp is connected to the fan. You see, you got one single switch, no noise, yes noise. I do wish they had two switches. A really big mirror here for you guys. Hmm. Towels going on, sink, hair dryer, 
a little slot for you to pull out tissue. Uh huh. Toilet and the shower. Hmm. I like these hooks. Hmm. It's like it's machined really well, you know. It got like little machine like they put they put effort in making this. And we got the shower. Hmm. I wonder how's the water pressure? Uh, aim it away from me. I'd say it's pretty adequate. It's not like the most forceful spray I've ever had, but it's pretty good. And just soap residue on the handle. So I gotta wash that off my hands. All right. So there we have it, guys. The Luxor One King Right, one king corner, right, which I guess this is the corner of the pyramid. Big sweet. All right, guys, thank you very much for you know uh, checking out this room with me over here. There will be a new Vegas video every Friday, and, and of course, more if I you know have more time to post more, but guaranteed every single Friday, guys. All right. Have a good one. Now this is nice. I, I, I enjoy this. I've been in the uh, small version of this room before near the top. And that is kind of like very clustered and crowded. But this has a lot of space. I'm loving this space, guys. I'm going to sit in this chair and do a little spin. All right. Ah. Here we go. All right. See you in the next one, guys. The bearings on this chair is amazing.